Hello, this is Mike Russell from musicradiocreative.com and in this video I'd like to show you the basic navigation functions of Adobe Audition using my magic mouse. Take a look at the screen now. Here's a waveform that I've loaded up about two minutes in duration. Now you can zoom in and out on this waveform by going up and down on your magic mouse like so. But there's also another way you can do it on the keyboard plus and minus keys, but it's not quite as smooth and fluid as the magic mouse. Now say I've zoomed into a section here and I want to scroll left or right, you can do it easily on the magic mouse by simply swiping left and right. It's absolutely easy. Now, if you want to go back to view all of the waveform, a keyboard shortcut that Adobe Audition allows is Command Backslash or Control Backslash on your PC. Next, perhaps I want to jump to a certain point in the wave. So say I want to go right to the start and trim it up. I'm going to select the start and then hit Shift and S to get me there. And now I can see a little bit of blank space at the start that I may well want to delete, for instance, and then Command Backslash to go back to the screen. Now let's head over to the multi-track and it's a similar function in the multi-track. Again, up and down on your magic mouse to zoom in and out, but you can only do it on the top bar here where the time is displayed. So do bear that in mind, but otherwise your shortcuts are pretty similar. Command backslash will take you all the way out. You can see I've got rather a lot of tracks loaded into that session. As you'll see from that quick tutorial, it's really easy to navigate around Adobe Audition. If you'd like to get Adobe Audition yourself or learn more, click the links below this video. I'm Mike Russell from musicradiocreative.com.